Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. This is Tink T, aka Latanya Christina. Welcome back to my channel of all things life, love, and beauty. I hope you guys had a great Thanksgiving. I hope you didn't overeat too much. Because actually, I know I didn't this time. I, I'm more of a, I just like the sides. So I ate macaroni and cheese and dressing and the greens and the yams, all that good stuff. And it was really good. So, but as we move into the weekend and we getting, we're getting much closer to the holidays and with all the holiday parties coming on, you know, if you want to go to work and then you're kind of like, oh, I want to change my makeup, you know, for tonight because we're going out. I'm going to show you guys how I do my day my day to night makeup so I'm gonna during the day when I'm at work and then at night you know I'm going out to a holiday party happy hour just want to look good and slay that's what I'm gonna bring you guys today a day to night transition look using one palette <laughs> I'm hoping just one palette something small you guys can keep with you and take with you and kind of just polish up your makeup a little bit so that's what we're gonna do today. So I'm really looking forward to doing this look with you guys. But before we get into it, please don't forget to subscribe to my channel. Shout out to the rooftops about Latanya Christina, AKA TT. <laughs> and hit the little bell so you know when my videos are uploaded. And don't forget to like and comment as well too because I would love to hear what you guys think and what you wanna see or any questions you feel you, feel you may have for me. So. We're going to get into this day to night, you know, sleigh look for the holidays. I'm optimistic. It's going to come out good. So you guys are going to do this with me. So stay tuned. All right. So let's go ahead and get this day to night transition look started. So for the day, because it's going to be a long day, I'm going to wear some of the liquid glow from Anastasia. And this color is Penny. And it's really kind of like a bronzy color. It's really, really pretty. And you put it on, you know, just kind of, you know, obviously before your foundation. And you just, I use this brush to kind of just pat it in there a little bit. This is a, I like this brush actually. It's a, it's a Sephora brush. And it's a foundation brush. It's a number 47 is what it is and it's got this flat head that I really really like you know if depending on you know how you apply your foundation this definitely kind of just kind of helps with with that and I really like this and this liquid glow oh yeah it just kind of gives you that that extra you know shine and then once I kind of get it to a certain point then I'll just you know start taking small swipes to kind of you know really kind of get it into my skin and so you know with the with the holidays coming you know and all the parties you know and sometimes you just kind of want to touch up your makeup a little bit and I get it and because I'm like I did this the other day I went out and I'm like I really really like you know what I did and so what you want to do you know or what I did was you know I, I for the day I went you know my my shadow is going to be really, you know, just not as intense, you know, as it would normally be. Because when I go to work, I definitely, you know, am not afraid to, to you know, to use any any sort of color. So, and I, we went to happy hour or something like that. And I, I took, I'm going to use the brown sugar palette here from Karuchi. Because it's small, you know, it's compact. You can stick it in your purse, you know, and then touch up. You know, I took just like a crease brush, you know, with me, you know, in my makeup bag and just kind of touched it up that way. And and I took it and I just kind of, you know, redid it for that night, added some lashes and a different color lipstick. And I was I was good to go. So here's what we're going to do for the day look because we're going to kind of, you know, keep it simple, but not. We're going to go in with this Sorrel here, this color here. And we'll start off with that. And as I've said, I've reviewed this palette here on my channel. And I absolutely love this palette. 
I probably could have done a week of looks with this <laughs> with this palette but I, I absolutely love this palette so and I like this color because it's kind of kind of close to my to my natural color so and it just it's a little darker obviously but it just kind of deepens up you know the crease here because again you know we're not not really going to do a whole lot you know for the for the day look and there's just going to be a lot of parties holiday parties drinking and all that good stuff like that you know coming up and then to kind of spice it up a bit i'm going to take this color here this is ginger here from the karuchi palette is it ginger yeah it's ginger so i'm going to take ginger and just put that all over the lid because it just this picks up some really good color here and I, this color is really pretty and yeah i go to work like this <laughs> this is really really pretty all right you know depending on you know where you work you know what you do you know you can you could be a little extra if you want to me no problem at all doesn't matter the only thing like I said before I don't really wear to work a lot of times is lashes and I'll wear them like on Friday when it's you know more casual I'll go that route but not so much as every day and some people do wear them every day I am just not one who wears them every day okay don't want to just put enough on there just to kind of give you a little bit of little bit of you know glamour there just enough so like that all right let's add some eyeliner I was gonna go with brown but I think I'm just gonna stick with with black and so for my foundation because I needed to last I've been using the Bobbi Brown the stick foundation this has been <laughs> my favorite foundation I've been using this foundation probably for a couple of weeks now and I'm almost out of it. Oh yeah, you can see the liquid glow. <laughs> like that. Yeah. I'm just kind of put this all over. Yeah. Really, really love this stick foundation. And this is one of the few foundations I applied with this Smashbox brush. It's a... Uh, it's a... Uh, it's just a, a blurring foundation brush. And to me, it works better with stick foundations than it does liquid to me it just it just works better for me now do I someone asked you know if I contour when I go to work I'll do a slight contour and that's you know but I do that you know a lot a slight contour you know meaning just using you know bronzer and and definitely using a highlighter you know, for the most part, but yeah, I I'll definitely, you know, do that, you know, here today. So for concealer, I'm going to go in with the Born This Way, and I am Butterscotch, and I'll go in with that, and you know, again, you know, I don't do a whole lot, but we're going to, you know, do as much as we can, you know, here, because we're going to be gone, and we got to look good. Mm -hmm. we gotta look good I don't you know as much as I wear makeup every day to work I don't I don't think I overdo it it's, uh, to my standards but the girl in the office they think I told you I've said a couple times they just think I'm just like extra extra with it and glamorous I'm like mm, no I just love makeup and you know I, I have so much of it and you know you, sh you should wear it we have a lot of it and it's <laughs> Definitely use it, you know, as as often as you can. So there's that. And let's just add some mascara blush, which I'm going to use. Hmm. I don't know what blush I'm going to use. I have so many. Ooh, let's go with raisin because raisin is pretty. Raisin is a MAC. It's a MAC blush, and it's definitely one of my favorite blushes. You know, so I do like to set my under eye powder. I'm going to go in with the Studio Fix C6 powder and just kind of set that, you know, where I place that, you know, foundation. And then we'll just kind of add some, some bronzer. 
all the places where I normally get oily, which is, you know, right up in here. That's where I get oily the absolute most. And yeah, so we'll, we'll clean that up a little bit. Okay, nice, easy day look. We're going to take some bronzer. I'm going to take my Bobbi Brown bronzer. And we'll add this. Because <laughs> this is deep, deep four. And we're just going to take this right here. Not too much. Just kind of deepen it up a little bit. Because that will work. Mm. This is probably one of my favorite bronzers. Is this? I just oh God, and I'm almost to the bottom of the pan. I'm. I don't know. I think I'm actually a little excited about that. Just hitting the bottom of of something. I hit the bottom of my <laughs> sweetest cocoa blush, and that's because I'm just obsessed with that, and I use it so much. But I'm actually getting really close, and I probably should have picked up, you know, one in the in the VIB. I'm going to go on with Raisin Blush from MAC because it's kind of a reddish, brownish color. It's one of my favorite, favorite ones from, from MAC. And this is going to be our, our easy day look. Mm. And just add. It's, uh, it's, it's just such a pretty, pretty, pretty color. This Raisin here. And it's matte too, so it's it's definitely gonna hold steadfast, you know, most of the most of the day. We're gonna add some highlights, some lips, and this is gonna be our day look. And I'm just gonna go in with hmm, booming ColourPop Shayla. Let's go in with that. Add some of course, I get it all over the place, but on my face. <sighs> and I always add too much. All right, so let's add some lipstick. Since it's sitting right here, I'm going to go with Cork Lip Liner from MAC. Let's just go with this. Now, as far as lipstick, you know, depending on, you know, what you like, you know, it... it it's really going to come down to that. And with this, I'm just going to keep it subtle and go with Cinnamon from ColourPop, part of the Karuchi collaboration. Oh, yeah. And go with that, all right? Mm-hmm. That's nice. This is an easy look you can do. And this is this is simple. You know, this, if you're comfortable wearing a shimmer, go for the shimmer. But this is a day look. This is... A day look and so we're just gonna change a few items you know as we transition into the day look okay so get an idea for this day easy couple minutes and then to spice it up for the nighttime hmm what are we gonna do we are definitely gonna spice it up a little bit so just hang tight let's just you know I'm gonna show you how I go from day to night Okay, so now we're going to move into our night look. We're going to go back into our Karuchi palette and just kind of touch up, you know, your makeup. And if you're oily like me, I keep blot powder handy. So, and that will definitely help. Now, but this time in the crease, I'm going to darken it up here with this color chalk here in honor of my loving husband. I call him Chocolate chalk you know for for short and I like this color because it's kind of a brownish reddish color and we're just gonna pop that look at that pop that in the crease there to kind of add some some definition some depth to the look deepen it up a little bit I'm gonna add a little bit more of ginger the color that's on the lid I'm just gonna tap on some more because you're just really kind of freshening up here. Just tap on just a little more here. Because you really kind of want it to pop. And that's exactly what it's going to do. Touch up your bronzer a little bit. Kind of go in with that. 
you know, and I picked these products because they're small, you know, the Boomin, you know, highlight, you know, the Shayla, you know, collab, you know, this compact, the Karuchi, you know, palette, you know, they're small items. You can just, you know, stick in your, in your makeup bag, depending on how big, you know, your, how big or how small your makeup bag is. <sighs> kind of touch that up a little bit. And then I'm going to continue with my raisin blush here and just kind of blush my cheeks out a little more just a little more add a little more uh, yes and see my highlight actually is still standing <laughs> add some lashes because it is nighttime so let's add some lashes all right and we're going to finish off this look we're going to go back with our cork pencil. If I can get the top off. Go back with our cork pencil. Got our lashes on. And I tell you, these are Dell lashes. I am loving these lashes. I absolutely love these lashes. Very, very nice. And I think they were only, I want to say $5.99 at Ulta. I mean, you can't beat it. And so for the lips, I told you we were going red. And since it's happy hour, we're going to go with Cabernet. It's a lip whipped cream from Joey. Mm -hmm. Okay, everybody. So this is the finished day tonight look. This is easy. All I did was use one palette, which is right here. <laughs> My Karuchi ColourPop Collaboration Brown Sugar Palette. And because again, it's small, it's compact, and I can, you know, easily put it in my makeup bag. And I went from a, a brown lip, the Cinnamon Color Pop, you know, cream lipstick to the red Cabernet from Jouer. So this is an easy look, you know, as we, you know, transition into the holiday season and all the parties and. All of that, I mean, this takes like a couple minutes because really once you do your makeup in the morning and night, it's just a matter of touch up and some lashes, change your lipstick and you're out the door. So I hope you guys like this day to night holiday transition look. Let me know what you think though. Please comment below. And don't forget to like and more importantly, don't forget to subscribe to my channel. Until next time, Latanya Christina is out, aka TT. Yeah. <laughs>